In this module, we'll provide a basic overview of the user management system for the dashboard. We'll review user information and permissions. The VMSG Dashboard System User Management screen allows a user with administrator permissions to add, update, or delete system users. Each dashboard system user can have unique access permissions to specific groups. The information captured for each user is a unique username, name, title, email, and phone. Each user is assigned to a default organization and group within the organization. Although this is the default setting, we'll show you how each user can be given access permissions to any or all of the other groups in the organization. Each user can be assigned to one of four sets of permissions. User is the default for a normal system user with read-write access to selected groups. The read-only user can only view the system data and run reports but not make any changes to the data. A partner user has limited access to select fields on the objectives and activities screens for updating their status. The org admin user can perform all of the functions of a normal user plus adding, updating, and deleting users, activating partners, managing organization categories and subcategories, and configuring selected system parameters. Each user can be given access to specific organizations and groups within the system through the user links buttons. The org links button allows you to select which organizations this user can access. Generally, there's only one organization. The group links button allows you to select which groups this user can access for viewing and editing. A user can be given view only access or view and edit access to specific groups. The admin links button allows an org admin user to be assigned as the administrator for select groups. The last function on this screen is the ability to enable document management for this user. If this feature is enabled, the user will have access to the documents for all of the planning elements. Thanks for reviewing the system user management functions of the dashboard. In the next module, we'll look at the built-in help and information features of the dashboard system.